First, let me say thank you to the Prime Minister um, for having this confidence in me. I'm very privileged to be able to serve him. Uh, I also want to take this opportunity to, um, to assure uh, my constituents and remind the country of the Prime Minister's promise to the country. Um, in two years ago now, that ministers who are MPs will have Wednesdays to remain active in their constituencies, and I want to assure those whom I serve at that level that that will continue. Um, in terms of clarity areas, I'm really looking forward to learning from and with the officers on the ground in the Ministry of Industry, Innovation, Science and Technology, because um, I know that they will have a lot to share about what they've been working on. Uh, I know that with respect to industry, that we have to be able to uncover and support some new and emerging areas and um, be able to identify high growth companies that will be able to add to economic growth and development for all. Uh, with respect to innovation, you know, this government, when we came to service in 2018, had a very clear agenda of bringing innovation to all of what government does. Um, I believe that we've been able to do that. A lot of that, um, there's a lot more scope for that to be put in place. Uh, this is a ministry that has a tremendous growth potential to be able to deliver. Uh, and so I look forward to getting on the ground uh, right away and really seeing uh, what my colleagues before have been able to achieve and what uh, I can build on with the help of the rest of them. I, Marshall Kelly, and Cattle do affirm that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Barbados according to law. I, Marshall Kelly, and Cattle do affirm that I will be faithful and loyal to Barbados and I will uphold the Constitution and the law. And I further affirm that I will conscientiously, impartially, and to the best of my ability, discharge my duties as a minister.